Hey, Brad here, and today I wanted to show you the automated Craigslist lead system. This is a way that we can leverage a few programs to do our lead generation for us. It's actually pretty, pretty nifty, pretty handy. So we're actually going to use a site called If This Then That, which is what we're looking at right now. It's ifttt.com. And basically what this is is a way to, there's a bunch of different things you can do on it. Um, you know, we're not even going to scratch the surface today, but basically what it does is it can automate actions between different websites. So what we're going to, uh, excuse me, websites and apps and softwares, it does a bunch of different things. It's actually, again, pretty handy, so I recommend you check it out. But today I'm going gonna, gonna to show you something very specific, how we can use the IFTTT program to help send leads from Craigslist directly to our email inbox. So all you're going to do is you're going to come in and either sign in or join if you are not a member and it's free, it doesn't cost anything. And so inside what we are going to do is create what they call a recipe. And when you first join, if this then that, they kind of walk you through how it all works. But I'm going to show you how to set up the automated Craigslist lead system, I like to call it here, with using, again, using Craigslist and Gmail. So let's go ahead and create a recipe. So it's kind of going to walk me through. So if this happens, so I click that. All I did was click this, and I come down. And you can get a good look of all the different sites and softwares and apps and whatnot that you can inter interact with with the if this uh, then that platform. But we're just going to come down and find Craigslist. So I click Craigslist. And basically what you can do from Craigslist is a new post that comes in from a, a search. So on Craigslist, so I'm just, I picked a random city here. I'm in Dallas. If I search for something, so let's just say I'm going to search for SEO um, gigs. <clears throat> and I can look at jobs, um, but I'm going to focus on gigs. I find jobs is more of an employment where someone's looking for basically to hire an in-house SEO. And if you, that's something you're interested in, I, I started off as an in-house SEO. Um, so, you know, it could be something if definitely if you wanted to get into it, but gigs is we're going to find more of the freelance type stuff. So let's just put SEO gigs and then we're going to search. So basically it's going to bring up all the different posts related to this search. So what, if this, then that is asking me is to choose a trigger, which is going to be a new post from search with Craigslist. So if when I click this, and it actually tells you here, copy and paste the URL from the results page of any search on Craigslist. And basically when a new post hits that search, it kind of meets the trigger criteria. So this is the search I want to use. I did SEO gigs. So I'm going to grab it, grab this URL, like it said, click new post from search. The search results URL is that. And then I can go ahead and create the trigger. So now I need to, so I already knows if this happens, then I need to tell it what to do. So I'm gonna click that. And I want it to send me an email. So I want it to send me an email anytime a new post happens. And you can do this for any city that you're in or any city that you want to target. So I just picked Dallas. And so anytime there's a new post, someone posts looking for help, with SEO in Dallas, it's going to send me, let's go to Gmail. Here it is, Gmail. I wanted to send an email. Now I just click that and I can put whatever I want in here. You can see here I can have it go to a certain address. So I've already set this up. I'll show you what it looks like in just a second. So you just put your email address here. What you want the subject to be? So this is post title. It's automatically going to default to the post title of the Craigslist ad. Um, I think I put on here dash 
from IFTTT. I can't remember what I put, we'll look at it in just a second, but you can add on whatever you want. And same thing with the body. So right here, the body is going to be, it's defaulted to the content of the Craigslist post and then a link back to the post. I can actually add something else if I wanted to um, and then I can add a attachment URL if I wanted to. And then that's it. I'm just going to hit create action and that's that's literally all that happens. And so we can come back up to my dashboard. I'm not going to finish it because I've already set this up and then it'll put your recipes in the dashboard for you. So let's pop over to my Gmail real quick and show you what one of these looks like. So this is a gig that was landed in Dallas SEO. Here it is at the top looking for Black Hat SEO help. It was the latest one that happened. So when it, when, whenever this person posted this gig in here or this job, it, the if this then that sent an email to me and said, hey, here, here it is. So I guess I didn't put anything extra in the subject line, but um, I could have put from if this then that or whatever. Um, but basically it tells you right here, it starts, it reads out a little bit of the gig for you, a little bit of the, what's, what the task is, what's in the gig. And then I can actually click here and actually get taken to it directly so I can interact with it, reply, whatever it is I need to do. So pretty easy to set up. So if you're not a member of If This Then That, I recommend going in and joining. It's free. And set up some recipes. Set up some SEO gigs and SEO jobs. Or maybe you're looking for web design, PPC. You can do anything, any kind of search. All you got to do is do the actual search, grab the URL, plug it in If This Then That, and hook it up to your Gmail and it will notify you every single time that there is a new post so you can stay on top of client potential client opportunities on Craigslist. That is it for today. I will see you back in the action map.